Hello, my name is Jason Calero, an employee of Copy Matter for almost 10 years, and I'm here today to demonstrate to you one of my favorite computers of all time, the Lenovo ThinkPad. Quick little once over on the computer before we get started. On the left hand side of the laptop, we have many ports I want to go over with you. Starting from the beginning, we have USB 3.0, two ports on this side. Then we have the, one of the newer ports out there called Mini Display Port to allow you to connect your TV or monitor or large screen to it. We have, an, we have an audio out to run your headset or microphone with. We have another VGA port, which is a very standard port, again, to run a TV or monitor with. The construction of the computer is very good. They use full copper heat sinks for cooling that vent the computer's temperature very good on both sides of it. The DC jack, they use a very durable DC jack that's not a solder design. We'll tap more into that later. Extended battery for great battery life. Again, USB port. This port's yellow. And what that means is it's actually a powered off port. So you can charge your smartphone or charge your tablet up off of your battery while it's just turned off. It's going to be turned off for the process for it. And again, we have more USB ports on around every side of the laptop. There's USB ports. It's a wonderful feature overall. Wi-Fi on and off switch, turn it offline. Media card reader, smart card reader. Now the media card reader, is that for uh, for cameras? Yep. You can take your card out of the camera and put it in the computer? Yes, it is. You can pull okay. your card directly Very out good. put it in there. Those are fairly universal, too, so they support many types of cameras. And did you say you've got USB ports all the way around the computer? Correct. On all sides of the computer, we wow. have USB ports. That's great, because I always run into a problem with just having one side available. Yeah, we, we see a lot of customers' computers as well that just simply yeah. only have a couple ports on one side, and so nice. it becomes very... Uh, very nuisance. We have an optical drive for your, right. to read your DVDs. The DVD play, burner and player. DVD burner okay. and player. Nice. There's a latch for security, so the computer can't open itself when it's upside down. Right. You have to actually release it. Gotcha. Hitting this latch, opening up the system. First thing you'll notice is very, very smooth opening up. They use stainless steel hinges. Mm which rotate all the way down to 180 degrees. Mm -hmm. Almost no other laptop in the industry does that. We so it's completely flat? Completely flat. Yeah. We have never in all the years in business seen a, think, seen a ThinkPad hinge break compared to hundreds and hundreds of other How many years computers. have you been selling these? Uh, we've been selling the ThinkPads I mean, in Anacortis for almost 10 years since we opened up for business. Mm, impressive. Well, wonderful computer overall. This particular unit has Windows 10 on it for an operating system. Important to note, though, they also are available for, in Windows 7 for the people who are interested in 7 continuously. Okay. Let's get this loaded up here. It's very, very fast, I have to point out. When you are in a hurry, or you're doing business, or just simply you know, in a rush, speed is always critical. These computers are very powerful. They run only the Intel series processors, specifically either the Core i5 or Core i7 CPUs, not to get too Greek for geek speak, but that's as good as it gets when it comes to processor power. Memory, they're available up to 16 gigs of RAM, which is insane for a laptop computer. I have to really point that out. A lot of mechanical features, though, about this system make it different than any other computer on the market out there. Most notably is durability. They are business-grade laptops because they're designed to be used. They're designed to be, you know, put the hours into. The keyboards, I use a lot of keyboards in my life on laptop computers. This is one of my favorite by far because of the full feedback fill. When you type on it, there's a response. The keys press in, they press out, and as a result, you can type an essay much more comfortably than many of the inexpensive keyboards we sell out there, what we call throwaway laptops out there in the market. Even the touchpads have an ultra smart software to allow things like two finger scrolling, multiple tap features, and more importantly, they put a little graded pattern on it, which makes it easier to use when you have a little bit of moisture on your finger, a little bit damp, you can still use your touchpad on the computer overall. Mm -hmm. Buttons that we can program for hotkey functions as well. Lots of thought and design is particular. Uh, is, that, is that for scrolling? Do you know what that does? Um, that is the middle mouse button. Okay. Actually. Oh, I see. For a three button mouse. For a three oh, button mouse. Yeah. You can actually program that button in the UltraNav software oh, to do different cool. features for you. Yeah, I know there are some games and some architectural software and stuff that use three buttons, and that's nice. This particular unit in front of you is the 14 inch. And as you can see, it has an HD 14-inch screen on it, so it's very high pixel quality. But what you can't see in the camera is the screen is actually an anti-glare screen. And if you're outside in the real world with the sun coming down or the sun through right. the windows, you can still view this screen. 
And in, in the real world comparison, showing a lot of the newer systems out there compared yeah. to the anti glare, you're not seeing a reflection of yourself. And I've, I've been in this situation before in a hurry when yeah. we've had to work on a system and you're literally watching yourself like a mirror because there's no glare technology. Yeah. And in the it. angle viewing is very good. I'm just noticing yeah. I angle view over here and still, still see it very well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Comes with an HD webcam at top as well. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So you get a webcam with them, okay? Yeah. Yeah. And, a, and a feature unique to the ThinkPad I want to point out is they actually have a light on the top of the laptop, referred to as the hood light. Could you demonstrate that? Yeah, and that allows you to. Light comes on. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It gives you just enough of a little bit of light. If so, when you're in a dark room, to light up the keyboard. Right. You see it easily. It lights up the whole. Yeah, I can see the reflection yeah. right here. Yeah, and and more. If you're trying to read a piece of paper or it's on your hand as well, that light is a lot brighter in a dark room than it looks. Yeah, I would imagine. Time. Yeah. And I notice it's got a, a lip right in here. What is that about? Well, a little bit of a design there to when you're again outdoors and you got the sun coming down. This little lip gives you just a little bit of protection for the glare coming in from the top or the light from the top of it, which doesn't look like much, but it sure makes a big difference when you have light above coming down to your laptop to protect the screen and let it continue to be easy, vis easy viewable for yeah, you. Yeah, because I've never seen a laptop that had a ledge there. They're all just basically flat. Yeah. Unique feature. And possible to show you on the video, but I wanted to point out that every ThinkPad has a very nice rubberized texture on the back lid, mm -hmm. which is really wonderful for one, just resistance to fingerprints and, and wear and tear over the years. These yeah. systems last like, like no other one we've seen in the industry. Right. It has a good grip fill as well when you pick it up. Mm -hmm. Overall, one of my favorite laptops in existence. Yeah. Now, I've heard the ThinkPad have some kind of that they're more water resistant than some of the others. That Good. Can you tell me something about that? Good question. Uh, Lenovo actually advertises that you can spill up to 16.9 ounces of water on the keyboard. Now, in, in the real world, we all know that spilling liquid on laptops should be avoided at all costs. However, this is the only laptop in the industry that actually has plumbing designed through the keyboard to allow the liquid to try to drain out the bottom of the laptop. If we flip it over on here, we'll actually see some little holes, a little watermark on it. See if I can get a close-up of that. And the design there is, is for when oh, there's yeah, a... Yeah, I see the hole there. And there's another one over here. Yeah, another That's here, fine. another one here as well. Let's see if I get a close-up of that for the... Oh, it looks like there's some kind of a droplet picture on there too, yeah. yeah. Plumbing for it to be drained 